Welcome to the penthouse at 993 Fifth on 80th Street. 5,500 square feet interior, four bedrooms, outdoor space across two levels. Now on the market with Sirhan Signature for the first time in over three decades. Let's go. Before I get to the details of this specific apartment, I have to mention the building. 993 Fifth Avenue is built in the early 1930s. It's an Emory Roth building. It is pre-war, gorgeous limestone facade, and it's famous in part because it also only has 17 residences. You have full-time concierge and doorman at the front of the building. Your mail is put into these little cute cubbies. Things haven't changed over the years. And there is an elevator person to take you up, take you down, cater to your every need. And this building was originally built, and you'll see there's, you know, buttons here for service, for help. I'm thirsty. I need water. Dinner. Is it ready? Little things like that you'll see that are crazy to us today. Private elevator entry grabs you all the way up to the 17th floor. And the first thing you're greeted with are these gorgeous views from the park, beautiful French doors that open up to that view right over the Met, which is pretty incredible that you are across the street from some of the most valuable pieces of artworks in the world. You've got this amazing double height ceiling, gorgeous chandeliers, and so much room for you to add your own touch and taste. Now this apartment hasn't really been touched in the last three decades, which means there's a lot here that you can restore, you can move into it today, but you can also use this opportunity to create your own powerful penthouse masterpiece. Now let's go into the living room. Now when I first saw this home, I looked at the park and just said, wow. But then I came into this room, which is double your average living room on Fifth Avenue and said, wow, times two. You have light on all three sides. The apartment has light on all four sides. And there's so many cool, intricate details, not just from the, the extra high ceilings and the terraces and the amazing park views from every single window, but you've also got a gorgeous marble wood-burning fireplace. And look at cool things like this. You know, if you're gonna restore the home or gut it, you can totally do that. You know, I would still keep things like this. Like, look at this key. Like, this is like out of a movie, right? It's still here. Like you'd want to hold on to these doors, at least I would, because there is so much in New York that is so, so, so new, and it all starts to blend together. When you buy this home, you're buying a piece of New York City art. And the layout here across 12 rooms, 5,500 square feet across two floors, outdoor space across both levels, make it one of the most spectacular penthouses you're gonna find on one of the best blocks, landmark corners in all of New York City and definitely on Fifth Avenue. And then we go into our den. Now you've got a great den, great home office. This is also a good opportunity to tell you that there's also a ground floor suite with full bathroom that could be available for purchase as well. Home office, guest suite, in-law suite, you name it, to have it in your own building is pretty incredible. You've got this gorgeous millwork with this ribbon feature all the way around. So you see, you also have another foot of space in the wall here. If you wanted to open this up and just make this your media room, right? Your TV room, your hangout room, your family room, you've got formal living, formal dining, formal entry. And then this is your lower level relaxation room. And you've got fun things here. Like we've got the padded wallpaper, which is just classic. Right, get some fun things too. Like, look at this. Look at these. Like, this is, I think, carved out of an elephant tusk. And it's, I think, I'm watching evolution. Look at this powder room. So, you might change the wallpaper, right? But look at these things that you, you might really want to think about keeping. And look at the inside of this sink. Okay, this is a Sheryl Wagner sink. These fixtures and this are worth a significant amount of money with the matching soap 
holder. Like if you get a, it's hard for you to see the detail on camera, but there is so much raised detail with the gold and the paint. Like I would be so nervous even about using this, but you can't. It's so usable and durable. They don't make sinks now the way they used to. And then you've got another door here that'll take you to the back hall. Because like I said, you have your little buttons, you're calling for maids, you're calling for service, and then voila, right through here. We've got our bar and then our kitchen. Why don't you meet me on the other side? You have two entry points into this kitchen. One here, right into the main living room and into the den where we just were, and then direct path into the main part of the apartment and right into the dining room. This kitchen is huge, fully windowed, beautiful views, extra high ceilings. This is a like chef's cook space. Now you can totally rebuild this all out, right? But you have, I mean, this is the biggest commercial vent I've ever seen in an apartment on Fifth Avenue. I mean, like this might remove the gray from my hair. It seems so strong. Huge center island. I love details. Like I just, I love the painted tile, right? It just takes me back. And I love too the sinks. Like, look at this, look at this, okay? So to keep kosher, I can't imagine when these were initially put in because you see just kind of the years and years of dinners, meals. So meat and dairy, I just think it's fun. Behind us, you have two guest bedrooms, staff bedrooms, however you want to use them with a beautiful full window bathroom. And then you have an incredible breakfast space with so much light, it's obviously why they chose it as a breakfast room when they were originally designing this apartment. It's an amazing living and eating space. This is a congregation space. And if you follow me this way, we make our way into the dining room. I want a door like that in my house. Formal dining, right off the entry gallery, right off your formal living room. I'm looking directly to the park from the head of the table, and I have massive park views here because the placement and how high this penthouse is over the neighboring buildings, I have a view out over our neighbor's gardens, which is beautiful, and then I'm looking all the way uptown to the George Washington Bridge and beyond. Probably the best views from any dining room on Fifth Avenue. And the hallway that connects us between formal dining and the kitchen is your back hall pantry your butler's pantry, you get another refrigerator or an extra sink back there and lots and lots of room for storage. All right, the top of the stairs, we're greeted by the park morning and night. And then people always say Central Park at night, you can't see anything. It's dark, obviously, just like the ocean. But here, because of the presence of the Met, all of Fifth Avenue and all of the Upper West Side, it's an amazing nighttime view. The sunsets here are pretty, Pretty spectacular. Upstairs, we have our primary suites. And yes, I said that plural. Primary number one, ensuite bathroom. That's extra, extra large. Tons of closet space, storage space, high ceilings. And then, you know, for who you love the most, your favorite, this bedroom also has its own outdoor space. Look at this. Look at what you can do out here. I would take every phone call out here. I'd wake up in the morning, I would do my homework out here. You've got your main terrace where we started right there that wraps around insane views. Like this is just nuts. And then it wraps all the way around. How cool is this? I'm gonna get an echo. Oh, there's the echo. How awesome is that? With the park behind me? Like you, you're owning the architecture here. Like this is Emery Roth design. That's what you're buying into. This is not just four walls. It's not just brick and mortar. You're buying art. It is what it is. When you buy a penthouse on Fifth Avenue, you are buying an art piece. And then this wraps all the way around, which gives you amazing opportunities for extra landscaping. Imagine every window just having greenery everywhere. You have irrigation out here. You have spigots for water. Just crazy. And we've got another bedroom here. Same high ceilings, bright light. You have Southern and Western exposure out over the park same access to outdoor space. If you are an outdoor space lover, if you want to be able to wake up and have your kids wake up and be able to open up their doors and smell the dew on the trees and the leaves that are in Central Park, you can do that here. So many people want to be on Billionaire's Row. They want to be so high, like they're up in a helicopter. But then you're just living with these almost fake views forever. Here, 
You're 17 floors up and you are in the park, but you are above it enough so that you have the perfect vantage point. Like this is one of the most valuable floors you can be on in New York City. The kind of 17th, 18th floor window, 170, 180 feet of elevation is the perfect vantage point of the park, the views, the sky, the city. It's pretty incredible. And then we have our second primary, the big one back here. And the primary is gorgeous. Now I would leave a lot of this millwork here because it's so unique and would be a fortune to redo. You have another marble fireplace, wood burning, another terrace, even bigger than everything that we've seen. You've got exposures all the way around, so much light. And this is great because you get all of the Eastern light coming in here. This penthouse, again, like I said, is 12 rooms. It's over 5,500 square feet, four bedrooms, plus staff, right? So if you count it out, there's five bedrooms in this entire apartment spread out over two floors and every single room is bright and every single room is amazing. You've got a huge ensuite here. You've got to see these details. Windows to your terrace spaces that you could totally landscape. I'm, I'm imagining you coming in here in the mornings to get ready for your day and you've got your rose garden that's here. I'm looking out towards the reservoir in Central Park, the Upper West Side, the George Washington Bridge, putting on makeup, whatever works for you. Millwork carries all the way around, a gorgeous extra long soaking tub, and then you've got this copper sink. Isn't that cool? I, I tell you, I say it all the time, they just don't make homes the way they used to. And then this is your front yard, your front door, your backyard. This is your commute to work, to dinner, to breakfast, your walk with the kids to school. You're gonna to go to the Met. You're gonna have so much fun here. Walk the dog and you're walking down Fifth Avenue. I'm gonna cross 80th and I think I'm actually gonna go for a little walk because it's so beautiful up here. This is our newest Sir Hans signature listing, the penthouse at 993 Fifth Avenue. Thank you so much for watching.